According to Ayurveda, every individual life is microcosmos, within the macrocosmos. That is, our body is the manifestation of the universe. There is a shloka, yat pinde tad brahmande. Pind refers to our body and brahman is the expanding egg, that is our universe. The macrocosmos or brahmand is encompassed by five great elements, the panchabhutas. These are akash, that is ether, vayu, that is air, agni, that is fire, apa, that is water, and prithvi, that is earth. Ether is called akasha in Sanskrit. It is omnipresent and omnipotent. It is the first expression of consciousness and is the basic need of our bodily cell. Ayurveda holds that within the ether there is a pure presence of spiritual energy. Air. The consciousness, when it moves in a particular direction, it becomes air. Prana is the basic principle of air element. It is the flow of consciousness from one cell to another cell in the form of intelligence. Fire. Where there is a movement, there is friction. And where there is friction, there is fire. Fire governs the metabolic process and the digestive process and regulates the transmission of our food into our energy. Water is called Apa in Sanskrit. It represents the chemical energy. Water is the universal solvent. Water maintains electrolyte balance in our body. The plasma in our body is composed of 90% water. This water carries nutrients from one part of the body to the other part. All solid dense and hard element is earth, prithvi. All solid structure, hard frame and compact tissues are derived from earth element. For example, bones, cartilage, nails, hair, teeth and skin are associated with earth. These five great elements combine together to form the three doshas or the three doshas. Ether and air combine together to form vata. Air and fire combine together to form pitta. Water and earth combines together to form kapha. Dosha literally means fault, mistake or impurity. These three doshas are present in everybody, in and everything. As long as the doshas are in equilibrium, they maintain a harmonious psychophysiology. The moment they go out of balance, they corrupt or pollute the dhatus, that is the bodily tissues. Now let us discuss each of the three doshas. Vata. Vata is the energy of movement. In our body, vata governs breathing, blinking, muscle and tissue movement. When vata is not in a balanced state, it produces fear, anxiety and abnormal behavior. Pitta Pitta governs our digestion, absorption, assimilation, nutrition, metabolism and our body temperature. When out of balance, pitta gives rise to anger, hatred, jealousy and inflammatory disorders. Kapha Kapha is the energy that forms the body structure and provides the glue or cohesion that holds the cells together. When out of balance, it leads to attachment, greed, possessiveness and congestive disorders. So guys, these are some basic terms of Ayurveda, some fundamentals. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching. Take care.